Welcome back to Dragon Quest Builders 2! Today we destroy that which we've gone to so much trouble to make. It actually didn't cost us that much in the way of trouble. But we need to dig this hole one down. Because the key to growing sugarcane is to grow it submerged in water. And now we have a hole that we can submerge in water. Here's our field. See if Wrigley's gonna actually do his job. Well, while we're waiting on him to do his job, let's fill this up with water. Oh no, you're not gonna let me do it there? There we go. Fill it up with this dirty, nasty water. Yeah, look at that. Look at how great that is. You gonna do your job now, Wrigley? Dang it. I guess he doesn't have to. They just have to till it. Because it is regular dirt already. All done. And all this farming has raised our town level up. So I'm gonna go hit that bell before I go plant these seeds. Hey! So what do we get at three? Ooh, specialists at sowing seeds. And some new friends. Man, now we can make these things. And bridges. Cool beans. And nameplates so we can assign a room to be somebody in particulars. Wooden doormat. Huh? Eh? Like, I know we just showed up, but you're sure doing a lot of sinning right in front of me. What with all that inventing and stuff. Hey, buddy! You like sinning? Yeah, we got uh, we got one of them right here. Don't don't worry about that. Yeah, yeah, he he's right there. Just go ahead and Oh, of course. Got to really dive in there. Experience the sin in first hand to see just how bad it is. Mm-mm, this sure is some mighty fine sinning you're doing. Okay, so let's go plant these. Man, I got 84 of these things. That's like a whole friggin' thing of them. There we go, all done. Full field of them. And like two people came up and wanted to talk to me in the middle of that, but I was busy sinning, so I couldn't very well talk to them.
So Rosie will come up and run, run to you as soon as the first little sprout pops up through out of the dirt. You do you, Rosie. Is growing on all that liquid in your brain. That's true, don't have to water it if it's constantly underwater. Alright, so while they were doing that, you had a, some kind of concern. It is! Look at all of that sinning! Yeah, I mean, all of this, uh... All of this stuff isn't helping. I suppose out there working in the farm day in, day out is also a little stank. I can make a bathtub! And we can all take baths! It's gonna be great! So I have a blueprint! And I can put it wherever I want. I'm actually going to be putting it over here. Hmm, how do I want to handle this? Because here's the funny thing, is... People take so long in these bathrooms that not everyone is ever going to be able to take a bath. So you want to build two of them. So I want to build two of them side by side, but I'm wondering how exactly I want to go about doing that. Because obviously I'm going to have to modify this after I build it the first time. Like, how about if I build that there? And then, like, maybe put the second one here? Maybe I'll just build the first one here. How many blocks is that from the back? Three. I think that's three. So, one, two, three... One, two, three, that's good, and then we can kind of square it out this way. So what do you got for me, blueprint? Alright, we got softwood, we got floorboards, we're gonna need floorboards under those floorboards. Uh, we got drapery doors, ceramic sconces, I've made, like, pretty much all of this before. So, should be relatively easy. So these are nice because it has the little blueprint symbol over top of them. So I know without even checking that, like, hey, these are for a blueprint. You may need these for later. And then this is real nice because it shows how many le are left that you need. So you can just kind of go down here and make everything you need. I love how the blueprints work in this game. And it has been pointed out to me that I was wondering, like, I was saying before that, like, it'd be real swell if there was some way to know how many of something you already have. And there is, actually. Um, pointed it out to me, like, back in video one or something. But you see the, in the lower right-hand corner, like, under, oh, crap. No, they're not. No, they're not. No, they're not.
I don't know what you idiots are doing. Okay, we did it. So back to what I was saying. Um, on the right-hand side of the screen, at the bottom, you see it says Simple Stool and gives you the description of it. And there's a little one in the lower right-hand corner of that. Which means we have one of those. So like this, we don't have any. This, we don't have any. But now I make it. And now we have one. Let's see, we also need one of you. Four of you. I'm really surprised I have, like... Oh no, that's grass fiber. Okay, I have. I think I have more grass fiber. And I think that's it. It should be everything we need. I'm gonna need some more floorboards though, because we gotta we gotta put a floor under this thing. There we go. Now let's get to business. Done and done! Now they can all stop being so stanky. And then everybody's gotta come celebrate. Look how happy everybody is. Giving me all their hearts. Just gotta run loops through all of them, collecting all their goodies. I kind of liked that, like, jokingly, like, almost flirtingly, like, don't you try to do it, tee hee, and then stopping going, okay, no, but seriously, don't. Now we can make a bath towel. And now, Bonanzo wants something. The heck do you want, Bonanzo? I mean, sure, sort of. <laughs> That's true, y'all aren't doing nothing. <laughs> I sure did. Oh, so I haven't actually done anything about them planting yet. I like how the guy says, I don't know if you recognize me, given that he's one of, like... Oh, it's actually a she. Uh, she's one of, like, the generic farmer people that show up that don't even have names. Heck yeah. I think we're fine right now, but it is getting... It is pop probably starting to get to the point. Well, we need to hold an election. Friggin' Malroth, what do you care? Okay, Malroth has a completely different idea about leader, but he does also make a fair point. Now 
quickly. I must be gone to go murder. And worst of all, he's right! You know a mayor isn't a ruler, right? Like, the mayor serves the people. You can't just do whatever you want or you get kicked out of office. Spinny. You know, that's a good point. Where did Deatrice come from, really? I mean, look, Malroth is thinking about the important things. Props to him for that. He's not just muscle. I mean, his solutions are always just muscle. But he's, he's thinking about problems that he can use muscle to solve. And really, no, every... Malroth keeps bringing up important questions. This is the second time, and he just gets brushed off with a change of topic. Like, no! Go back! I want to know the answer to that question! Listen to ya, boy! Alright, so everybody's still got stuff for us. Man, I got, like, things to do, though. What do you want? Thanks for noticing! Just a tiny room with a pot and a towel rail. I see where you're going with this. I see where you're going with this. Okay, what do you want? Not here they don't. <laughs> I've eaten it. A lot. Oh, I actually have some bread for you. I've got some right now. I mean, I didn't make it just for you, but I have it. So, like, sure. I mean, again, I didn't actually... I like this little kid. She's alright. Man, I don't know where you got those, but I'm cool with that. Lillian, smack her. Mmm, 
you guys getting in on the sinning too? Just diving right on in. Okay, so we've got some work to do. We gotta make a poop hole. We gotta make a kitchen. And we gotta make... A second one of these, because look at this line. And just, like, watch for a minute. Really, Malaroth? I mean, dude's gotta stay clean. But, like, you'll see how many of them actually make it through. It's like two, or something. So, we should clean this mess up a little. You having fun out there, Malroth? Hey! With the double bath is done, this should go a little bit e this next one should go a little bit easier. I don't know where I want to put the poop bucket. There's enough space here that I'm feeling that maybe. I don't know if I want to put it back here. We're kind of crowding that bell anyway. Look, we're going to be moving this eventually anyway, so let's just go ahead and put the poop bucket back here. Um yeah, this will be good. So this doesn't have to be very large. Um, in fact, that's all the smaller it has to be. A very tiny room is, in fact, very tiny. And then all it needs is... Poop pot. And a place to dry your hands. And a door, because nobody's doing that with the door open. So I should have in here... There we are, a nice, simple, tiny door. There you go, hope room. And everybody is so happy. I can imagine. Getting that fiber. Does that mean we don't poop? So this may possibly be a little gross, but that's exactly what's going on. And hey, you know what poop's good for? Fertilizer, yeah. All right, so we still got, we got to make a kitchen. We got to talk to you. You just called me handsome. I mean, I appreciate it. I think I would prefer pretty.
Yeah, remember, uh, remember that room we just made? That's where you get night soil. Still gross! Alright, so last but not least, we need a kitchen. There we go, we did it. Everybody's clear. I need to take all your hearts. Everybody on the celebrating need to go back to sleep? No, they're just terrified. Uh, we can deal with the terrifying, we can deal with that later. I want to sin. <laughs> yeah, we did it. So all that's left now is for all of them to stop being scared. Also, we need to help out Wrigley. And that's about it, I think, for the most part. We also need to put down chests around our fields so they can all take care of those for us. I think we may want to move our dining table a little. Maybe light things up a little bit more. I could put another couple light sources around. Yeah, we could do a little tidying up. Do a little tidying up. Till next time, everyone when we do a little tidying up.